one fall. Introducing first, at a combined weight of 499 pounds, the Celtic warrior, Sheamus and Cesaro. Now time for our huge six-man tag team match. And I can't think of any competitors I'd rather see go at it right now than these six superstars. This one's gonna be great. Just moments away from what will likely be one of the most exciting six-man tag team matches we've seen in a very long time. Well, given the two teams we have assembled here tonight, I would say I have no choice but to agree with you, Cole. level inside this arena right now not the least bit michael this is the one the wwe universe has been looking forward to for quite some time Entertainment. Triple H. And that goes for both in and out of the ring, Michael.
Big match here as we kick off this three-on-three -three contest. And Tulsa has been stirring all night in anticipation of this one, guys. Wow, look how quick. Just an unforgiving slam. Now we have Dean Ambrose on the attack. As the action continues, let's discuss Dean Ambrose briefly. This is not the type of setting he normally competes in. So when you're in there, how do you make the necessary adjustments so you still end up on the winning side of things? In there right now, we are looking at arguably six of WWE's most iconic individuals. This team looks ready for anything in there, but we'll see if that takes them as far as they need to go to win this match. This is some great offense by Sheamus. Since exploding onto the ECW scene in 2009, the Celtic Warrior has made a habit of beating people up and winning championship gold. Sheamus' power was so impressive, it even landed him on the cover of Muscle & Fitness magazine. Oh, I think this man means business. Sheamus looking a little shaken here. And you know all three of the superstars he's up against won't back down at any point during this match. I'm not going to go so far as to say he can't win this match, but things certainly aren't looking good for him right now. Through his battles with the likes of Triple H, John Cena, The Shield, Big Show, and Dolph Ziggler, Sheamus has established himself as one of the most powerful WWE superstars in sports entertainment today. Guys, just listen to this and tell me if this isn't dominating. Sheamus is a former WWE champion, a former United States champion. He won the 2010 King of the Ring, the 2012 Royal Rumble, and a 2015 Money in the Bank contract. He's in trouble. The lunatic fringe has him right where he wants him. Yes! He's back in control here. I think Dean is. His shoulders are down. There's a chilling fury that's behind Sheamus' eyes. The Celtic Warriors' goal is to pummel whoever steps in front of him in his quest to dominate. And he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. Seth Rollins knows how to polish off an opponent. Sheamus' legs looking feeble. He could be on his way out of this one. He may very well have reached the point of no return here in this six-man tag team match. Not to be presumptuous. Call super kick! Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Seth Rollins just changed the momentum of this match. Over the course of his career, the Celtic Warrior has proven to be one of the most dangerous superstars in WWE. Sheamus has shown his ability to seize opportunity at anyone's expense, hence being a former Mr. Money in the Bank. Sheamus is battle-tested and can inflict serious harm on whoever he feels deserves it. Just look at the classic best of seven series the Celtic Warrior had with Cesaro in 2016. What a knee strike from the Kingslayer. This one's over. He may get the three count right there. What an amazing six-man tag match. Decisive victory here tonight. You can bet there's going to be a celebration tonight.
And that's the kind of action we've come to expect here on Raw. What an amazing match. 